How to use Paint Co-Creator to create AI images in Windows 11. Before we start, I would like you to hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Tech Digest. What is Paint Co-Creator? Paint Co-Creator is a feature embedded in the Microsoft Paint app. It can create multiple versions of images using DALL-E, an image AI system based on the text inputs that you provide. Apart from that, it offers multiple styling options for the images, which you can use to generate images belonging to a particular theme. The Paint app has already received significant upgrades like the Fit to Window option, support for image layers, and a background removal feature. How to use the Paint Co-Creator feature the Paint Co-Creator feature is in the experimental phase and available to Windows Insiders. If you have enrolled your PC in the Canary, Dev, or Beta channel of the Windows Insider program, you can try out the Co-Creator feature. Release Preview Insider users will have to wait longer. Firstly, update your Windows Insider PC to the latest available build. After that, check the Microsoft Store for updates to the Paint app. The Co-Creator feature is available in version 11.2309.20.0 or higher, so you need to update it to access it. You can also consider using UF Dump to download Windows Insider builds without enrolling in the program. Make sure that you are signed in with a Microsoft account on your Windows 11 PC, otherwise, you won't be able to join the waitlist and use the feature. After that, launch the Paint app, and you will see a Co-Creator feature icon in the app. Click on it to open the feature in the side pane. Now, click on the Join Waitlist button. You will receive an email from the company in your official Microsoft account about getting access to the feature. Follow the below steps to use the Paint Co-Creator feature. 1. Open the Paint app. 2. Click on the Co-Creator icon in the top menu. It will open the feature in a side pane. 3. Type a detailed description of the image you want to generate using AI. We typed a cat wearing a pirate hat, riding a car, in the countryside, detailed. 4. Click on the drop-down list below to choose a style option. Click on any option, or you can keep it as no selection. 5. Click on the create button. 6. Wait for the feature to generate the images based on the prompt you provided. It can take a while to create the images and fetch them from the server. It will produce three sets of images for each prompt. 7. Once the images are generated, you can click on them to add to the image or empty canvas. 8. To save the generated image, click on the ellipses icon of the image and select the Save Image option. 9. Name the image and click on the Save button to save it in a PNG format. Similarly, you can try more combinations and styles to generate different images based on the same prompt. Remember that creating an image consumes one credit at a time. Is Paint Co-Creator any good? Paint Co-Creator produces a set of three images with each prompt. We like the idea of integrating the predefined styles option into the prompt to make the image accurate. However, the feature takes a bit longer to fetch the images from the server. The save feature allows you to save any of the generated images in high resolution, but the resolution is capped at 1024 by 1024 pixels. In the experimental phase, you only get 50 credits to try out this feature. After that runs out, you can still use the Copilot to generate images using the Bing Image Creator. Generating Image Using Copilot Integrating the AI image generation feature inside the Paint app will be a boon for users. The app already has support for layers and a few other features which will surely reduce dependence on third-party apps for basic image annotation and editing. Non-insiders will have to wait a little longer to try out Paint Co-Creator. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen, because I'm sure you'll love them.